Good morning, everyone. So it's day three, and uh, I'm all packed up and ready. But I'm just waiting for George to have our breakfast. The good news is that we tried out George's bike last night, and the, the engine seems fine again. But obviously, there's the, the, the probably something wrong there. So it's probably best not to stress it too much. But we decided not to leave it here and just 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 push on. So we're going to Legaspi in Albay today. Uh, visit uh, the Raga Church, um, also Kansaba ruins, which is the, the iconic picture uh, in front of Mayon volcano. Uh, it's drizzling a little bit, but then it's on and off, on and off. So we'll push on today. But as I said, we, we probably won't stress the bikes too much, um, just to make sure that uh, it runs safely. And uh, so we might strike out some, some minor sites along the way. So I'll catch you on the road. It's like running through an open door. It's like finding what you're looking for. We've been waiting. We won't wait no more. Every season, every memory made all the dreaming that is here today. Okay, let's try George. Alright, let's give it a go. So how is it? In episode 2, you'd remember that George's motorbike encountered some engine issues. So we are a bit fortunate that his bike started well this morning. So George, how was your conversation with Archie? Oh man, uh, so happy. Um, so here it is. Uh, we are six, nearly 600 kilometers from Manila, right? Yes. And they're going to send me a uh, service bike. Oh! Uh, just to get back on the road. I mean, we're riding now, but... It's still 50-50 whether this bike can still fulfill the whole journey, right? So yeah. it's better that I, I call for a service unit. Archie's kindly uh, offered to send one down from Manila. Wow. So that's, um, hopefully that's being organized now. And that's going to be sent to uh, Mississippi Bay where we're headed. In addition to George's engine problem, we also encountered heavy rain early in our journey. So we had to take extra care on the road. We also decided to skip a twisty coastal road that was supposed to provide a great view of the Philippines' east coast, but we instead took the shortest path to Legaspi City to visit the Kagsawa ruins beside Mayon Volcano and the historic Daraga Church. After that, we would be traveling to Visibis Bay Resort in Albay Province. The entire trip for the day will be around 148 kilometers.
location we've arrived at Kagsawa Ruins. There's a trove of tourists here, uh, mostly local tourists. Um, um, Mount Mayon is covered a bit, but yeah, let me show you. The Kagsawa Ruins are the remnants of a Franciscan church that was originally built in 1587 in the town of Kagsawa. The church was burned down by Dutch pirates in 1636 and was rebuilt by the Franciscans in 1724. However, on February 1, 1814, the strongest eruption recorded to date of Mayon Volcano buried the town of Kagsawa along with the church. Only the belfry and some parts of the convent remain. The eruption killed around 2,000 people and the survivors resettled into nearby Daraga, which was then a mere barrio of Kagsawa. The two locations were eventually merged together into the municipality of Daraga. Okay everyone, so behind me is Mion Volcano and then we just came from Kagsawa Ruins and now we're here at the Raga Church. The Raga Church is officially known as Our Lady of the Gate Parish Church in the municipality of Daraga Albay. The facade and its walls are made out of volcanic rocks and the white highlights in its facade are the result of a coating of lime for protection from deterioration. It is one of the few churches in the country that has four spiral columns known as the Solomonic Columns. It was a common belief that the Raga Church was built after the eruption of Mayon Volcano on February 1, 1814 to replace Kagsawa Church, but it was actually built by the Franciscans much earlier, in 1773. Nevertheless, the residents of Kagsawa did relocate to the Raga after the 1814 eruption destroyed their church. The church is known for its churicuresque architectural style in its facade, which is a fine example of Baroque architecture. The National Historical Commission of the Philippines unveiled the church's historical marker on October 16, 2008, and the National Museum of the Philippines listed the church's eastern and western facade, belfry, and baptistry as a national cultural treasure in 2007. After admiring the mythical ambiance of the church's exterior, I decided to finally go inside. I 
I cast all my cares upon you. I lay all of my burdens down at your feet, and any time I don't know. What to do? I will cast all my cares upon you. So, when we arrived earlier, there were a lot of people here, and all of a sudden, they all just left at the same time. Maybe there was a wedding, and they were they were all part of one party but I'm quite fortunate because the church is now quite empty and very solemn. There's a collection of images here. Let me show it to you. It's to the left side of the church. We're now off to ride through a winding road that leads to Misibis Bay Resort in scenic Kagraray Island. Shout out to Dindon. He's, yeah. uh, he's gonna tour us around um, uh, Mississippi Bay. All right. There's the tub. Mm, there's a toilet right there. Okay. 
that's me. I totally look out of place in this very nice room. Okay, do the bed. And Okay, there's the beach. So uh, I got a uh, seafront unit. I think George also got a seafront unit. So it's really beautiful. Really beautiful. And right there is the Pacific Ocean. Made it. You made it. Where are we? Mississippi Bay. Mississippi Bay. All right. Time to have some little fun. We go back to our work. We have to eat, right? What's our last meal? Breakfast. What time is it now? 7 a.m. last meal. Now it's what? 3 3.40? No, no, 3.20. Uh, well, Late they don't lunch. know this when you're having fun, right? Yeah, no, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Okay, guys, I have a new subscriber. His name is Fritz. Shout out to Fritz. And here's the evidence. Subscribe! <laughs> Voila! <laughs> Do the same, okay? <laughs> Shout out to my new subscribers, guys! Bye. John and Fritz of PCB Space! Subscribe now, guys! Let's go! Joel on the jet skis. Getting ready.